Hey everyone, Alex here from Android Headlines, and today we are unboxing the Smartisan T2. Now here on the Smartisan T2 with the box we have a silhouette of the actual device on the front so you can see exactly what it looks like in it. I mean it looks pretty plain but wait until we actually take it out of the box. Now on the back we have the specs listed which are mostly in Chinese but some of the stuff is in English. So we have a 4.95 inch full HD display, uh, 3 gigs of RAM, a Qualcomm Snapdragon 808 processor. We also have 16 or 32 gigs of, gigabytes of storage. Now we do have a 32 gigabyte version here. I'm not sure if it's listed on the back, but it is listed in on the device inside the software. Now it's running Smartisan OS, which is based off of Android, and it is running Android 5.1 Lollipop. And once we take the lid off of the box here, we have the paperwork right there on top, which as you'll see it is in Chinese, as which is expected since it is made for China. And right here we have the phone. Which is a it's it's a really nice looking phone to be honest. Now you see we have a middle frame along with the glass front and back, and we'll set that aside and see what else we have in the box. Underneath the phone we have our wall adapter as well as our micro USB cable. So you'll be able to plug it in obviously. Now the wall adapter is it's a little different than what you'd normally expect from a smartphone these days. So what we have is a round adapter instead of just a plain old adapter, which is it's nice to see that. And as you can see, Smartisan does pay attention to detail as you can see with the packaging for the micro USB cable here. Now going back to the phone, we have the volume buttons on each side. Now the right side does double as a SIM card slot. So that's taken after what Motorola has done with a few other phones like the Droid Turbo where the volume rocker is the uh, SIM card slot, which is it's pretty nice because now you don't have a, another sp space on the frame that works as the SIM card slot. And now peeling off the front uh, screen protector here reveals the beautiful looking display and that's saying something even with the display not being on, but it, it does look really nice with that uh, 2.5D Gorilla Glass right there. Now on the front we have our front facing camera as well as our earpiece with all of our sensors in the earpiece. Pulling off the back, we have our Smartisan logo as well as our camera and LED flash back there. And the, the back looks really clean. I mean, that's that's literally all you have is the camera and logo. On the bottom, we have the micro USB as well as the speaker and microphone. Up top, we have the 3.5 millimeter headphone jack and another microphone hole. Now turning on the phone, you'll see that it has English selected already, which we'll stick with that since that's what we speak. And then we'll go on to the end user license agreement and take care of that and then we'll set up our Wi-Fi now it's asking if we want to do one-handed mode well it's not asking if we want to it's asking which hand we want to use which will be the right hand but it's nice to see that the left handers are also accommodated here now we have smiling cloud here which allows you to sync a bunch of stuff from your phone like the contacts notes calendars alarms bookmarks settings and a little bit more of that now you can decide to do that later if you want to now we have the warranty, which we're gonna go ahead and skip. Then we have location services and usage data. And then we have a video that shows us uh, what the launcher is like, because this is a different launcher than what we have on pretty much any other phone. Um, it is a typical Chinese phone where it doesn't have an app drawer, but it has a three x three grid, which can be doubled to an 18 grid. So that'd be six by three. And that's pretty much it for now with the Smartisan T2. Uh, we'll definitely be coming back with lots more on the Smartisan T2, which does work on both AT&T and T-Mobile. You get full 4G LTE on both networks. Now, if you like this video, make sure to subscribe as well as obviously like the video and we'll see you in the next one.